Two men, two parties. Dueling speeches. Dueling speeches. Dueling, Dueling speeches. Like a dueling speech thing going on. It's what? Be like a battle rap in Eight Mile. <laughs> Thank you all for being here. Good morning. The Constitution must never, ever turn our back on its enduring principles for expedience sake. We uphold our most cherished values because doing so is right, strengthens our country, keeps us safe. Pretty clear the president served in the Senate, not in the House, because of course in the House we have the five-minute rule. Our government made decisions based on fear rather than foresight. A sense of general alarm after September 11. Trimmed facts and evidence to fit ideological predispositions. 9-11. 9-11. 9-11 made necessary a shift of policy. In other words, we went off course. That's why I took several steps to better protect the American people. For me, one of the defining experiences was the morning of 9-11 itself. Some have argued brutal methods like waterboarding were necessary. The interrogations were legal, essential, justified, successful. I could not disagree more. The right thing to do. I bear the responsibility for keeping this country safe. I categorically reject that these are the most effective means of interrogation. Quote, recruitment tool for the enemy. The existence of Guantanamo likely created more terrorists around the world than it ever detained. This recruitment tool theory excuses the violent and blames America for the evil others do. We're cleaning up something that is quite simply a mess. Nothing but feigned outrage. A misguided experiment. Contrived indignation. Words that, frankly, are calculated to scare people. Phony moralizing. Rather than educating. We said we would never forget what had happened on 9-11. There are those who think that America's safety requires us to walk away from the sacred principles. We hear such voices today. Thank you. And they will never be able to do that if we stay true to who we are. Thank you. God bless you. God bless the United States of America.